Welcome to PGH. I am Coach Horn. And I am not <laughs> Eddie Groves. So, all right, all right. I'm Coach Horn. I am this is... Coach Groves, the one and only. Guys, we are going to talk to you about Schoology today. Got some important information. This is specifically for who? Hey, scoot over, man. Hey, there you go. This is for our at-home students. Now, we've drank a lot of caffeine. So may, if we get in a hurry, we apologize. We're going to do our best to slow down, keep this simple. But this video is just for you. For Nobody you. Nobody at school, for you. just for those Absolutely. that are at the house. Yep. So um, I hope it's been a fun journey. I know it's been a little confusing for some of you, and that's why we felt like we really needed to do this. And we're going to do our best to make you feel comfortable about what's going on. And there, there has been some confusion, guys, about your assignments, and we've gotten a lot of questions. So, And some of you may, may have the same confusion, but you haven't reached out to us yet. So hopefully this will clear up uh, what we are doing. So at this time, I am going to change scenes over here. We are going to go to Schoology, and we want to take you guys through uh, what each week is how they are laid out and what we are doing. So this is my online course. Coach Horns will look different because he has a different icon. But this is for our online students. So when you go here, I've got everything in a unit one folder. And then right here it says, read this first, the week of 831 through 96. You'll get this every Monday. The dates will change and the information will change. It kind of lays out uh, what is important. Go ahead and open Unit 1 folder for me. All right, so we're going to open up the Unit 1 folder. Coach Horns looks similar to this, or mine looks similar to this. You'll see the timelines, the archaeology, yep. and the Mesopotamia, where we are up to this week. That's right. All right. And each one of these uh, folders represents a week's worth of lessons. So timelines was basically the first week that we did. And we want to take you guys through this. This is in the Timelines folder. This is your first graded assignments. And what happens is we put a little video in here for you to welcome you to class. And then here's the first lesson, 1.01 Timelines. Coach, talk about what we got going here with the tabs. All right, so the lessons, the purpose of them is for you to practice what you're supposed to know. They are not going to be graded. Start off on that. But you need to do them or you will not be very successful on the graded work. You won't learn very much. So you have your first your tab on the left. There's the introduction. And then there's a little video here for you. It's going to tell you about what's happening with this topic. Watch the video. Enjoy it. They're always really short. The next tab, it says, is learn. This is where you're going to practice with what you just saw in the video, and you'll learn some new stuff. Click through everything. It's kind of obvious what you have as you're going through that with the vocabulary. And then you'll see these sub-tabs. This one's called What is a Timeline? And all the different units have these sub-tabs. Go through them. Practice, practice, practice. Struggle a little bit. Read. Reading is very good for you. And then you see some more practice. at the end. All right, after that, you hit Try It. So after Learn, then you try it. You're going to practice with what you learned here. This happens to be a drag-and-drop situation. All of them will not be the same. Maybe other little pictures and tabs you open up help you along. You take your time, you'll be able to find everything. Hopefully you all got to do this one. If you didn't, go back and do it. You need to begin, become very familiar with timelines. And then, after you've gone through, you see there's some more sub-tabs at the top with the vocabulary and all. You'll see this thing called task at the top. And we're gonna say this together. Do, do not, not do, do the, the task. task. Do, do not, not do, do it. The task. So once you finish the try it, you're ready to get out of this. Well, they could take a look at the unit vocab. Yeah. Those are the things that they got in. I mean, it's good to just read over that. Though, that's really a great thing to do early because that's stuff you're going to see throughout the rest of these folders in this first unit. Okay. Right. So now we're back into our folder. So now we've done the timelines lesson. Now we want to do... 1.02 timelines AD, and you're going to go through the exact same things. We're not going to take you all through it, but you got introduction, learn, try it, and do, do not, not do, do the, the task, task in unit vocab. And now, here's the big things. Anytime you've got something that says graded assignment in parentheses, that's what's going to be a grade that week. Right now, in our grade book, we have two grades for y'all. You want two to do grades. these last. 
Okay, this is the last thing you should do. So when you click this and open it up, here's what the quiz looks like. And a lot of people are having trouble, like, how do you submit this? Well, you go through the timeline quiz, you select all of your answers. This is a, only a five question quiz. Um, now, now note here, it says, if your selection is false, type in the correct, the correction for the underlying portion. So you'll actually type what is right here. And you continue to go through this. And when you get all the way to the bottom, there is a submit button. It won't let you submit until you've selected every answer. So now I can click submit, and then you're going to be able to have that scored. Okay. We will see that grade. That's exactly right. We will see that grade. And once you're done with that, guys, really simple, you're going to move on to the next graded assignment. Once you complete that, you're done. So go back into the Unit 1 folder, or for Coach Horn, you would go Timelines, and then Timelines Practice 2. Now let's quickly look at this week here. This week, we're going to skip archaeology, prehistory, and civilization. You're going to do the stuff in it. Yeah, you are. We're skipping it, so yeah. we're just caught up to the week we're on now. We're on week three. So this is week three. You're going to go through all of these little things. These are very short videos and your lessons. It's information you have to have. I don't skip it. That's don't right. Don't skip it. So super short videos. It looks like there's a lot of stuff here. There's really not. And then this quiz will be 14 questions. Notice it is at the bottom because you want to do it last. All right. All right. Well, if you have any questions, uh, email us. There is a message in there, a little message button. You just message us. We'll get back to you as soon as we can. We've had a lot of messages lately. So maybe we, I may have skipped one or two, but we're going to try to you know, answer all the questions. Typically, it's, it's something that you've rushed through. Or you try to do the task when you shouldn't. Um, those great assignments, you get one chance at them. Go through all the practice, get comfortable, your great assignment, and then that'll be that. Be positive and get ready to move on, and that'll be that. Yes, sir. Contact us here, guys. Yep. Email us through Schoology. It's, it's best to send us a personal message to ask questions rather than to respond to any of the announcements or assignments because we may or may not see that but we will always see those emails. We get those alerts. We know uh, that, that you have reached out to us. So always go that direction with that. And that's going to wrap it up for us here at PGH. If you guys have any questions or concerns, reach out to us. We're here to help you guys. We hope everything is going well, and we look forward to seeing you eventually. Last thing, believe in yourself. And keep on dreaming. Yeah.